I'm now joined by Adrian Troy, Director of Product for Generative AI at Snowflake and co-founder and CEO at Streamlit. Adrian, such a pleasure to have you back on the program today. Thank you, I'm super happy to be here. Snowflake recently announced Arctic, the most open enterprise grade LLM on the market. Can you share more for our listeners about what this is and why this is so powerful for both the open source community and all the users? So first of all, as you mentioned, it's a fully open source model. All of the weights and even the cookbooks and data recipes have been released to the public. That's a huge deal when it comes to academics and community members being able to understand and trust how the LLM itself works and play with it, edit it, understand what the weights mean. The second thing is that it's really actually very good at a bunch of enterprise tasks. It scores super highly on reasoning, on code generation, on all the things that you'd want an open, you know, an open source enterprise LLM to do. But I think the actual coolest thing to me is that it is a really unique architecture. So it's super efficient to train uh, Arctic and also to fine tune it on sort of customer and custom use cases. And it's just awesome to see Snowflake playing now a fundamental research role in the foundation model world like it has in the database model world for so many years. It's an exciting next chapter indeed. We find ourselves in the new era of enterprise AI. How does the AI data cloud position its ecosystem for success in this ever-changing competitive landscape? Yeah, you know, it's really simple. Generative AI is something that's perfect for Snowflake customers. Uh, it's an incredible new computational ability that we can apply to large amounts of data, but it's also incredibly easy to use. And so the answer is three things. First of all, make it easy. Second of all, make it secure and easy to govern so that we understand exactly what's happening with the models and the data and their joint interactions. And finally, make it super efficient. So, as I mentioned to you before, Arctic is super efficient to train, to fine tune, but also we want to apply generative AI at the scale of trillions of rows of data efficiently and cheaply. That's our destiny in this world, and we're already making it happen. I love it, the trifecta indeed. As a founder yourself, what advice would you like to share with the builders watching today regarding proper AI implementation and how they can harness an AI-powered apps to drive value? Oh my God, I, I started a company five years ago and I'd be so excited to start one again today. So one of the really unique things about this era is that traditional uh, developments in machine learning really required a lot of expertise to use. With generative AI, it's actually very easy to use the most advanced AI technology in the world. For example, in Snowflake, you can now apply uh, an LLM to a huge data set in a single line of SQL. That's a sort of remarkable combination of simplicity and advanced technology coming together. And I basically would say, what a unique and amazing time to build. That's a good point, Adrian, an exciting next chapter indeed. And clearly the AI buzz is all around us here at Snowflake Summit. What are you most excited for this week? There's a ton of cool stuff. Actually, uh, I'm super excited about the keynote. We're going to talk about some of the customer success stories using generative AI. One of them is actually Zoom, applying generative AI to a huge data set of video data and enabling us to understand, categorize what's going on in those videos. It's a super amazing use case. Uh, it's all on Snowflake technology and excited to see those kinds of production use cases cropping up all over our customer base. It's all happening here at Snowflake Summit. Adrian, always a pleasure. Before we go, as you look out on the rest of 2024, how do you see the AI landscape evolving and where do you see Snowflake playing a role in this? Well, one of the key things about AI in general is that you go to it to seek answers about complex data sets. At, Sno at Snowflake, we can have some of the largest data sets from some of the most important companies and other organizations in the world stored with Snowflake. The ability to use AI to gain cognition over those giant data sets is really the future of AI for enterprise data and something that Snowflake is playing a leading role in. Adrian, always a pleasure having you on Data Cloud now. Thank you so much. And for the audience watching, I'm Ryan Green and this is Data Cloud Now.